here's a video on how to get the eSheen ROT G02 5.8 gigahertz receiver to USB to work with a Samsung Galaxy S8 Plus and the new current as of Black Friday 2017 Gear VR by Samsung. Pretty easy. The eSheen actually comes with a cable. It has one that's USB-C and then it also comes with the older style micro USB for your older style phones. The Gear VR has a USB-C port on it. So I put a little, little Velcro on here. Just uh, Velcro this onto the headset like that. Then on your Android device, lock it here. You have to download a program called Play Cardboard. That program makes it so it doesn't automatically open the Oculus software when you insert it into the VR. So we'll select the cardboard. Cardboard mode enabled. Alright, so exit out of that. Put it in the gear VR. I have is called FPV viewer seem to work well open that and I got your various settings there Go to connect okay and there it is on the screen I got the ad version so I need to get the paid one so I don't have the ad pop up here. Okay, now we'll plug in the blade torrent by E Flight. Okay. Tricky to do this one handed here. Okay, I'll open that FPV viewer back up. Connected. Okay, again. And there you go. There's the initial screen and with the buttons on the ROTG, you can adjust the channel. But, um, yeah, here it is. I've seen other reviews, they claim of uh, it's too much latency to fly, but I find it as uh, actually pretty decent. I can fly just fine on it. No problem at all. And wide field of view. I mean, it uh, looks like I'm mean, not a crazy acrobatic pilot, but for flying around, I mean, it. Seems to work just fine. Highly, highly recommend the Ishin ROTGO2.